see. Some lady was killed here. They said beheaded. There's another stone up here we're looking at. Okay, so I don't know if you can read this. It says, the cruel and bloodthirsty savage who took her, slew her with his hatchet at one stroke. Rev. John Williams of Deerfield, the redeemed captive, so wrote of his wife. That don't make sense. Mrs. Enos Williams, who, who was killed at this place March 1st, 1704. So this is the forest right next to that um where that lady was massacred. The river's down there. And that's where she was beheaded supposedly. Right on the other side of that dam. I don't know if we can see it. Right uh right there. Now, a lot of Indians used to be in these areas a long time ago. And I don't know if there's anything left behind. I wish I had a metal detector with me. Just listening. I hear something out there. These woods are supposedly haunted. There's a... She wasn't the only one massacred. There was hundreds. Almost 300 years ago. Yep, I hear something over there. Could be an animal. The way I'm facing my camera is just forest. 
for miles and miles and miles. Mountains. And a river that runs right through the valley. Or through a valley of mountains. I gotta remember too that there's a lot of black bears in this area. And they climb trees. <laughs> so they could be above me and I don't even know it. I've seen one before in a tree. Look at the. Sounds like a woodpecker, but if a woodpecker was the size of a dinosaur. Those trees are swinging. It's really windy. I gotta be careful for hunters. I wore a bright blue shirt just in case, but it's hunting season. See, there's another, another sign. A couple of them. You hear that? Sound like a cry. There's something out there. I just don't want to come across a big bear or something. That would not be good. I do have a knife with me just in case, but... That's not going to do a whole lot. Looks like a trail. Goes right out. Through there. Let's go up here. Somebody's had some fun up here. I would really like to see if I could find some, uh, some, um, what the heck are they called? Oh yeah, Indians made them. Arrowheads. This looks like it was pushed at some point. Maybe a tree fell over. I did bring a shovel with me if I wanted to dig a little bit. Some glass here. It's dangerous. For an animal. Walk over there. Right down there is where they say you can see her at night on a full moon, you can see her holding her head standing in the water. I have yet to come and see that. But I don't know if I'd want to. I will. I mean, if I could catch that, oh, I think I'd uh, be the number one sought at video, sought after video. But yeah, the water here is crystal clear too. It's real clean. You can see right through it to the sand. I 
There's uh, actually a really good big rainbow trout in there. Now there's another posted sign. So somebody owns all that or something. But this is a trail here. Yep, some trees have been cut down. Those are definitely cut. Oh, could be beaver. Or hacked. What does that look like? Okay. I don't know. Oh. But it's kind of odd. They're all kind of cut out with sharp points. Somebody comes through here at nighttime, they fall over. They ain't making it out of here. That's actually real odd. There's a ton of them. There's a trail that goes way out there. I can see it. I wonder what that's from. There's a lot of the trees are cut down right there. I don't want to walk past that though. I really don't want to get in no trouble. Some people will set up cameras, deer cams. Yeah, there's too many posted signs right there to go through there. One, two, and there's a bunch that way. Right there's one. I'm not gonna bother. It just looks real creepy over that way. The trees are all dead. Super windy. I can't. I don't know if you can tell on the video or not. I'm not gonna go past those, but I'm gonna walk right over here. Take a look. That's the river where it happened though. She was beheaded by the Indians. I just feel like I just heard a whisper or something. The weirdest sound. I hear something. Either somebody's coming or I hear leaves crunching, branches crunching. Let me go up the side off the trail a little bit. I think this is where I came from. What's that? How's it going? Good, yeah?
Oh. <laughs> Get the photos? Yeah, I didn't know. That big pine tree. Yeah, it's a big tree for sure. If I stood under it, I'd be somewhere right about there. I'm six one. Oh, I just seen, I think I just seen the bald eagle. Hold on. Let me see if I can walk over there. I just seen black and white. Could have been the sun hitting all crow or something, but it went right up there. up there a little bit. Oh, nope. Not a bald eagle. Definitely a woodpecker though. Oh, shake it. Right behind that bush. Maybe if I get lower. Get him better. Where the heck to go? There he is. Should have used my bipod. Anyways, not the bald eagle. That was a little odd. I knew I heard something. I'm glad it was a person and not a bear. But then again, the guy kind of creeped me out too. What the heck's he doing way out here? Doesn't look like a high traffic hiking area. So my camera times out at 19 minutes. I had to start over. Let's get out of here. So this big tree that I was at, something was just telling me to dig in front of it. So I just dug a little bit, and I don't know what this is, but it is definitely some sort of elastic, maybe some underwear or something. That is odd. Maybe somebody crapped their pants up here. And buried them. And I just kicked around the poop. You know, those things been here for a long time. And I ain't gonna check the tag. I just hope there's... It feels like something's in there. Maybe I'll have to come back. Leave a comment saying, come back, and I'll come back here, and I'll dig that up with my shovel. I could come here at nighttime, but man, I don't know. Leave that in the comments if you want me to come here at night. This is the bridge. It's not the old one. They redid it because it got flooded out. This is where it all happened. None of this used to look like this. This is all forest. 
This is recently cut down. And they made a road here. And that's the plaque. The tombstone. <laughs>